Welcome back, boys and girls. Hasn't been that long, but it's been enough time for us to get 51% in this war. And he's willing to accept peace. So let's do that. That means he's going to get imprisoned. Alright. So be it. Also, built a large stable. Hooray. He should accept peace. Should is such a strong word. Alright. May Allah destroy your house. I accept your peace. Yep. Poor guy. Alright, now that the war is over, I think we should start cleaning up our country a little bit. Alright, that's all of our troops done. Yes. So first and foremost, let us revoke some... Oh, actually, let's uh, make sure you are researching tech. Let's revoke some titles from people who have been assholes to us. Let's see, it says this guy is a traitor. Minus 100 relations. So that means we can revoke his titles. And we'll eventually revoke both of them, but for now, let's do, just do Sinar so that we can take that over. Actually, no, we don't want to take that over directly. Well, maybe what we'll do is we'll start giving stuff to our grandson. Let me save it quickly. I want to see if if our son will leave our court if we give him a uh, place to rule. I mean, not our son, our grandson. Because he wants to have a title. Oh, look, his stewardship went up by two. Awesome. He wants to have a title, but he's currently our steward. So if he loses the stewardship, then I won't give him the title. So let's see what happens if we try to give him the title. Let's give him Jerusalem. Man, that's a nice place. Look at all that shit. Oh, there it is. Yes. Yes, he did leave our court. No, he didn't. Okay, but someone else left our court for some damn reason. Our fucking vizier left our court. Oh, because our vizier was from Jerusalem. Gotcha. Let's see if we can invite him back. Damn. Let's see if I can figure out how to do that again. Search vassals. I think it was that guy. Oh, man. She would make a good vizier. But she can't be the vizier because she's a she. All right, let's try to invite him back. We can't. Interesting. Okay, let's try this dude. Yes, okay. So we gave our son Jerusalem. That means we can now revoke this title. Sinar. Wait a minute, didn't I just revoke it? Oh, it takes time. Okay. Built a stable, that's nice. Alright, so this guy's now in our court. Let's make him our vizier. He's not going to live very long, but at least he's good at what he does. I will accept your decision to revoke the grand city of Sinar, though it grieves me deeply. Yeah, well, deal with it, dickhole. Alright, so now we have a wrong type, wrong type of holding. So we are supposed to... We have to revoke this one as well. Oh, but he likes us. Damn it. I don't want to do that. Oh, 
Okay, another question for you guys. Since I have to be the one in charge of the uh, castle to make it a correct holding type, how do I do that? Please let me know how do I do that, because I would love to be able to switch uh, the holding. Rather than holding the city, I would rather hold the, uh, the castle. Maybe, oh, that's what I can do. I can build a new castle. That's what'll work. What else will work, though? Let's say there's a province like this one where it's full. How would I do it then if the city was on top and not the castle? Let me know. So in this one, what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a castle, and then when it's built, I will own it. And that should switch the castle to the top, and then I can give the city to a new vassal. All right, we also need to revoke at Barra. So let's get to doing that. But first, let's give... Madara to our our. Uh, I guess we'll give Madara to our. St no, let's get uh, our stupid grandson. Yeah, let's give it to our stupid one. Hey, he's like, duh. God, that face, that face. He he just looks slow. It's like, duh. What's up, pops? We're gonna give you uh, Madara. Oh, Madaba. I'm sorry. <laughs> he was our... Oh my god, we have nobody who's good at learning. He was our chief Kadi. That's amazing. Alright, let us get a new chief Kadi. Search vassals. Ooh, yes. Fight to court. We can't. That sucks. You can't do it because you're a chick. You can do it. No. But you love us. Damn it. He loves us. We like him, and we can't invite him to court. Damn it. And the rest are girls until you get down to this guy who doesn't even like us. Damn. Well, then. You'll have to do... Then we'll make him our Grand Vizier. I mean, our, uh, what's it called? Chief Kadi. Alright, so we got rid of a domain, so let's revoke Atbara. You have a lot. Atbara, Negev, Hebron, and Tajura. Well, we want both Atbara and Tajura, but we'll have to do them one at a time, I guess. Uh, yep. Yeah. Since he's a traitor, our vassals will not object, so there you go. And he's in prison, so we get the response right away. Cool. Alright, we now have Atbara. It's not the best place in the world. It only has three, uh, three cities. Well, city, castle, and church. But it doesn't, there's no room for anything else. That sucks. Alright, so as soon as that guy comes to our place, we will move him up the ranks. Alright, here you go. Chief Kadi. Hell yeah, he wants to become Chief Kadi, so even better. Now we're going to research tech in our capital. Alright, things are moving in the right direction. I would like to revoke more. Like this one, I definitely want to revoke. But he likes us right now, so maybe we'll just leave him alone for now. Yeah, he's not a traitor, so this will reduce our vassal's opinion by 20. So I don't want to do it, because he's not a traitor. Can I revoke more? Nope. So we'll, he'll, he'll have to become a traitor again before we can revoke more titles. And he has three more titles to revoke, so... Uh, give it time. Nope, not a traitor. Can't do him. I already did him. Oh, he has Karak and Acre. Ah. Oh, that's right. He's the son of this douche. Well, not a douche. He's a good, good guy. And he died in prison. Alright. 
who's going to revolt? Prince Amr. Really? Fuck, man. Go for it. You have the Sheikdom of Montreal. That's all you have is Montreal. Well, go ahead and revolt. And then we will take that Sheikdom from you. There's a 100% chance that he will revolt. <laughs> yeah, go for it. Now, see, we have a title that we can claim over here. We can get Beta from our nephew. I mean, he likes us, but we could take Beta. We could do our de jure claim on Beta. We could offer... Uh, da, 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 da. You're at war, so we can't offer... Yeah, yeah, we can. He's part of the Caliphate, so we can't offer him vassalage. Can we offer this guy vassalage? Yes, we can, but he would say no. How about these guys? He would say yes. Let's do that. Yes. Alright, we're going to get these guys into our kingdom. Oh, there we go. Amir just declared war. Well, that didn't take long. Alright. Now, I imagine you don't have a lot of dudes. You have 704 guys. So I'm not too concerned. We're going to go meet up here, and then we'll go kick your ass, okay? Yeah, I swear fealty. Good, good. This guy should also say yes. There we go. So we now have these guys as our direct vassals. So, yeah, someone reminded me that we should be uh, offering vassalage rather than just going on the warpath all the time. Oh, that's right, we also have her rare. We should give that to... Was it you had a claim on her rare? No. Is it you? No. Well, someone, one of my vassals had a claim on Herrera, but I guess he lost it. Oh, well. We also need to get uh, Ancober back from this dickhole. That will happen eventually. Because Ancober is not our direct vassal. He's a vassal of... Well, he's his own dude. Which is not cool. He should be under us. Like these guys are under us, and then we're under the caliph. Ah, we'll figure it all out. So you don't like us. That's why you would say no. What about your heir? Your heir likes us. So your heir will probably say yes. So we'll just leave Kathri alone. And then when uh, his heir comes to power, he'll probably accept vassalage. No problem. So I noticed our our icon changed. I think our icon used to look like this, where it was a hexagon. But maybe I'm wrong. Maybe my maybe our our icon always looked like that. I'm not sure because it's a sultanate. I would love to know how to get into this uh, voting thing here, but I think what was mentioned in the comments of one of the videos was that we can't really get into the voting here. It's just not possible. The only way we could become the Caliph is after a hundred years of having the kingdom in the Caliphate, it would become a de jure part of the Caliphate, and then we'd be able to take the Caliphate. So, 100 years from now. Alright, do we have any prisoners? That's a good question. We do. He's our nephew. Well, we'll just leave him there. No, he has to revolt again. Yeah, we'll, we'll let him out. That way he can revolt again. <laughs> Once he revolts again, we can revoke another province from him. 
and we're out of time. So thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed this episode. Next time we will... Well, next time we will finish the war we're at, and we will hopefully get Kathri to accept our vassalization offer. That'd be nice. So, this is Shenra signing off. I'll see you guys then.